but I only see a talking moose. Where are you? Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Franbo. <laughs> so, we made it out of a thirst. Uh... <laughs> so I'm actually really excited that we're finally out of there because I wasn't sure how much more I could take of those puzzles <laughs> in a thirst because they were starting to get really hard and really bullshit in some situations. <laughs> But we are out of Ithirsta, and we're about to explore this new area. Um, we did find our pills, and they got taken away, so there's probably somebody that's going to be messing with us in this area, I'm not sure. Um, but we'll see what happens. <laughs> Alright, let's go, Mr. Midnight. Yeah, you... You always clean yourself at, like, every time I acknowledge you. <laughs> it always happens, God. Ooh, oh, home. Oh, home. Home. I guess home is in that direction. Oh, we're going home. Oh, berries. Hmm, delicious berries. Oh, are we are, are we going home? Pills, don't move. Ugh, you want me to show me the way back home? I don't think it's showing you the way back home, Fran. I think... I think that's danger. I, I, I don't trust... I don't trust the pills. Oh! I told you I don't trust the pills! Oh no, I, I shouldn't have touched the pills. Bad, Fran. Bad, bad. Oh, but I got a knife, though. <laughs> I got a knife, though! <laughs> oh my god. Fran just never gets a break. Jesus. Hello? Fran, you already here. Well, I wasn't expecting you until 2.35. And as I see it, you are not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am it- It word! It word! It, it word! Interesting! Oh, I, I've heard your name from somewhere, it word. Huh. Your faithful friend. Edward, do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, Fran, we saw the name in various places, actually. Yes, I'm the creature of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you get to Mr. Mid... I helped you to get Mr. Midnight back, you see. Really? Huh. I think I imagined quite well to find my kitty on my own. I mean, we did kind of technically find the- how did you- unless he set it up for us to find- to free Mr. Midnight. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it was me. You see? But that's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean by they never looked into themselves? They blamed me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear Fran? The long man with the top hat. Yes, we saw you at, like, the beginning of the game. Like, in the facility. Then we saw him at the sisters' house. I don't think we saw him at, at a Thursday, though. I always came by by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. What do you what do you mean by come by at night when she was a baby? I came to you after you imagined me. Is this our imaginary friend? But I'm not imaginary, you see. I'm part of your reality. Okay, see I like how he corrected that. <laughs> Did I imagine you? You look quite familiar, yes. I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you were able to imagine me because I already existed. Anyway, we don't have any time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to take you home. Follow me. Take me home, you say? 
Hmm. I can't trust you. <laughs> Why should I, sir? I can't just trust you. I won't hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. Hmm. All right, you seem nice. I'll go with you, but I won't trust you yet. That's fine. Come on now. I have something to show you. Oh, okay. Oh, ooh, you are tall. Holy shit. Oh. I, okay. Um. <laughs> I'm concerned. Interesting. Behold the it word flying machine. What do you think? Um. Can it can it fly? It's all right, but can it fly? Yes. With this gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. Oh. Are we finally gonna go home? We'll fly as soon as I fix the details. Besides, it's not 235 yet. What is so special about 235? That sounds great, but what is it about 235, sir? I don't understand. See, me and Fran are on the same wavelength here. <laughs> It's when time becomes slower, and that gives us a chance to enter the Ultra Reality. Ultra Reality? Inside the Ultra Reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you are part of the third reality. Do you understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. <laughs> But sir, should I just wait until you are done fixing the machine? Wait? Of course not! You can help by getting water and fireberries, alright? Um... Alright. Alright, it's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great! Here is my amazing handmade bucket for the water. I made it myself. Interesting, it looks very vintage. <laughs> Ah, and the fire berries. You'll realize which berries to pick up because of the fire. All right, but sir, can I just ask, why do you need the berries and the water? Ah, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is to get rid of the dirt, the kamalas. Oh. Oh, kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know, but we do know that they don't like water, yes? Oh, darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine, you need it. Some things are still invisible to your eyes, you see. Here. Thank you for the pills back. Invisible to my eyes? Hmm, I see. Well, thank you. I was trying to catch the pills... I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh, yes, about that. I'm sorry. I needed to get your attention somehow. It's okay, sir. I defeated the trap, like, in one second. <laughs> yeah, we actually did. <laughs> anyway, I'll go get the fireberries and the water. I'll be right back. Great! I'll be preparing the machine. All right. Okay, um, I guess we're gonna get some fireberries and some water. Are there any fireberries here? <coughs> oh. <coughs> what, what the fuck? I was not expecting this so soon. What? Ew, I look completely deformed. Fran, how are you not concerned? <laughs> okay, let's go. All right, any fire berries? <laughs> right, okay, what, what are you? Wow, so much hair and so shiny. Yes. Oh, 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 these are the, the, the thinkies. I feel like in a magical world of hair. Okay. Oh, oh. <laughs> Get. 
Oh, get out, get out. You're, you are trespassing on my territory. Huh? Excuse me, I thought you were dead. Yeah, what the fuck is, why is it talking? How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry, but you seem to be all rotten and bloody. Me? Rotten and bloody? I think you are mis misunderstanding the situation. How am I m misunderstanding? Why does the sign say hell? <laughs> Why do you say that, Mr. Moose? Mr. Moose? But I'm not a moose. I'm a daedal worm. Oh, I'm a deadly worm. <laughs> a, a deadly worm. Excuse me, a deadly worm? No, no, not a deadly worm, a deadly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. I just give back to the soil what creatures took from it and don't need anymore. But I only see a talking moose. Where are you? All right, fine. We're not taking these pills ever fucking again. I swear, we're just gonna go home, throw away the pills, and like go through the withdrawals that we need to go through, and just finish this fucking shit. I'm tired of this shit. <laughs> I'm tired of this shit, Fry. <laughs> God damn. Down here, creature. Can't you see me? My name is Fran. Oh, there you are. You are so tiny. Hello. My name is Fran, and I'm not phased by this at all. <laughs> God. <laughs> Hello, Fran. Can I ask why did you touch the moose in the first place? Normally, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I was trying to see if I could climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it is possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. Yes, I see the fire, but I have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Climb on now. I'll keep working. Thank you, sir. I can't take the fireberries. They are on fire. I need the water, don't I? Well, can I use a knife, though? I could cut the berries off the tree, but they are on fire. Look, you can just cut the berries off the tree and then put out the fire with the dirt, blood, vein, flooring, whatever it is. <laughs> just take it out with that. I have no water, do I? Yeah. It could work if I had water inside the buckets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Fran, let's go. Wow, so much hair and so shiny. Yeah, let's let us let let us get back down. Um, <laughs> we need some water first, Fran. Oh, hello. Hello, are you those shiny insects that get stuck on trees because of curiosity? We usually get stuck, yes. How do you know this? You are not one of us. I met your kind before, long time ago. <laughs> I met some of your kind before. I helped them get free from curiosity. Ah, that that is very nice of you. Curiosity can lead us to unexpected situations. Are, 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 are you stuck? Do you, do you need me to help you? Yes, I think curiosity is a good thing, but are you stuck? Not at all. We are just trying to make our hair the longest hair ever. Wow, that sounds amazing. Good luck. I have to go now. Bye. Yeah, bye. <laughs> All right, let's let's take the pills back and where where am I gonna find water? That's what I want to know. Where where is this? Do you have water inside of you? Nothing, of course. What was I thinking? Yeah, what was I thinking? Trying to get water from a body that's getting eaten. Eaten to shreds, of course. <laughs> oh, 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 do you... Can you get me water? I need help, please. Would you allow me to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to our hair? Why? That sounds insane. 
Oh, it's not insane at all. I need water from the from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. <laughs> all right, we'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Oh, thank you. You are very nice. Fill up the whole bucket, please. Oh, thank you. Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm so smart. Let's go. The bucket is now full of water. Oh, thank you. Shiny insects. I have to go now. I have to go home. Yeah, we need to go home. Like, now. ASAP. <laughs> home is somewhere we all wish to belong. But does home belong somewhere? I, I, I don't understand what you mean by that, miss. Or sir, whichever you are. What? I'm sorry. I didn't really understand the question. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that you are your own home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. Oh, that sounds mysterious and beautiful. I'll try to do that some other time. Bye. Bye-bye. Give me my fucking bucket. <laughs> so I can get the berries. Oh, the bucket is full of water. It doesn't weigh like anything. Yep. Uh-huh. Now let's climb up the moose. <laughs> and get my fire berries. Oh. Let me climb again, please. <laughs> get out, scavengers. <laughs> I can't even do his voice. I'm so done with this shit. <laughs> Can I climb on you again, please? It's me, sir. Can I climb on the moose again? Go ahead. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> okay. God. Now let's put the bucket on the berries. The fire is gone. I can take the berries now. Yep, and then we can cut up the berries. Ooh, be careful, Fran. I feel like you're gonna fall. That does not look sturdy. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's climb down. That was very scary, Fran. Right. Okay. Take out. Take, okay. I had. I have the stuff, sir. Here. <laughs> I have the things. Sir, I brought the fireberries, but they are not on fire anymore. Magnificent. They will do just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. All right, and then here's the water. Sir Itward, here's the bucket full of water. I got help from the shiny insects. You mean the luciferns? They are nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you ever see them in the fifth reality. They can burn you. Oh, that that's nice to know. Wow, burn me. Well, I haven't been to the fifth I haven't been into the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What's reasonable there may be the worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, Fran. Ah, Fran, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. Right, okay. I'm suspicious about this. This was too easy. <laughs> I'm very suspicious. Let's go, kitty. Ooh. It actually did fly, okay. It's 2.36. We have a great possibility of reaching the target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, Fran? Um understand more whatever that means <laughs> maybe i would be excited if i could understand more about the realities you'll soon understand the answers are not easy to recognize um sounds strange huh that sounds strange to me sir time goes as it has to in order for you to be alive if it all happened now you'll probably explode Oh, that's very reassuring. Are you telling me that the answers I'm looking for will come will come to me when they want? Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say 
through time, you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answer will come when you find them. Not when others tell you how or when to find them. Ah, I see. Well, I'm excited now. You woke up my curiousness. That's the best thing you can do for yourself. Be curious and you'll always be amazed. But now, Fran, we have to get things done. Talking won't take you home. What things, sir? Yeah, what, what else do we need to do? <laughs> the machine needs some maintenance and I think you would do incredible work. Here are the fireberries and the water you gathered before. All right, thank you. You'll need them to get the water pump working again and the fuel mixed. You'll find all information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room, any room you wish. I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Um, I've never done this before, sir. This is obviously new technology for a probably, what, 12-year-old that, you know, I could literally kill us right now in like two seconds <laughs> if I do something wrong. <laughs> hmm. But I've never done anything like this before. That makes it more exciting. Have fun, my darling. Okay, yeah, he, he's a daredevil. <laughs> All right, I'll go now. Yep, I'll go. Just trust me and my cat to do the right thing. Yep. Maybe I should push the button to open the door. Ooh. Hmm, this music makes me think of, think of forks. How? <laughs> How? Oh, ooh, ooh, I got tape. I'll keep this. Duct tape is always good to fix stuff. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, Fran knows. A hammer. Obviously, the hammer stuff. A wooden foot reminds me of me when I was a tree. Oh, that's cute. Interesting. Wait, wait, wait. What? Wait, excuse me? <laughs> I just realized what this was. Wait, wait. Okay, so... So you take the skin off the bottom of the foot and then you put the skin on the bottom of the shoe and then you you attach it to the shoe and then you tie up the shoe and you That must hurt like a bitch though. Are those your feet, sir? It worked. Oh, this looks very complicated. I'm, I'm glad you noticed. I wonder what this machine does. You and me both, Fran. <laughs> Hello, Fran speaking. Uh, all right, let's just push the button and go. Ooh, oh, it's the kitty! Hello! Uh... Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was going to be in the next room. Wow, that's a huge spinning top. Interesting. Look at this mess. Edward doesn't know about hygiene. Do I take these? This pink hose may be good to connect somewhere. Blue hose, ready to use. Ooh, uh, okay. Oh, oops. Um. Uh, uh. I think this should be turned on in order to work. Interesting. Okay, okay, okay. So, 9JM. I'm assuming. And then N16. Ooh, okay, N166. And then PL33. Okay. And then 2PF. Am I supposed to somehow connect the hose to things? Oh, wait, no, I put 2PF here, though. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, wait, water. Nothing, of course. What was I thinking? I was, I was kind of big brain with that one. Okay, okay, use it. Hmm, this one doesn't fit here. Okay, um, how about... Okay, obviously. Aha, you see? <laughs> obviously. Oh shit, okay. P 
he goes on the spot. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Uh, but... I don't know. Okay, anyways, um, I think I'm on the right track. I think I'm on the right track with this. Okay, 9JMM. Okay, 9JMM N166. PL35. 2PF. Which didn't do anything. I don't have AFM, but I have R15. That's not what I want. And then A18. I wanted A18 to... Okay. Can I use my matches? Oh! Okay. Interesting so far. What do you have inside, little bottle? Uh-huh. Anything else? Can I use a duct tape somewhere? No, okay. Oh, oh wait, do you use the fire berries? In one of these things, maybe? Oh, the fire berries that aren't on fire. Into the vase, ready, ooh, okay. I'm so guessing everything right now. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm just combining random shit. Okay. So now I think the order is reversed, actually. So we have the fireberries, and then this is... That would be 9JM. This would be... No, no, no. 9JM, right? Okay. I don't have everything. I don't have everything I need. But I will soon. I will soon. I will soon. I think I need more stuff. Because I need, like, to put, like, water, I think, or liquid inside those things. Hmm. Are those a drink of water? They are quite small. The vase has no flowers. Well, I'll just leave it there. Interesting. Oh, interesting. What is this? We have a machine that looks like this one at home. Really? It's totally empty. I wouldn't be surprised if this is where I have to put whatever concoction I made into. Or not, or water. And then we duct tape it. Oh, I'm so smart, let's go. And then we close it. Wait, oh wait, does that mean I can... Fuel it with water. But I don't get the I don't get it. <laughs> right, yeah, because you see the pipes. The pipes go to this. Okay. Um Oh, there goes a that would help, actually. Reality view, ultra reality view. Chemical mixture. Okay, let me take a picture. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna remember this. There we go. Okay, fireberries. I'll put the diagram right here in front of me. Interesting. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go into the reality view. Or, yeah. Oh, the ultra reality view. Reality and ultra reality. Interesting. Yeah, very interesting. Uh huh. So, am I like supposed to like tweak this I don't get it nothing's happening I'm not getting like a switch confirmation or anything okay um pencil I don't need this pencil I already have a crayon the pencils are better Fran Anyways, let's go this way. Oh, interesting. Oh. This lamp looks like a teapot with forks and spoons. Very interesting. <laughs> Ooh. 
it feels like something is missing. Hmm, the keyhole requires a key for sure. Right, okay. So I have to find a key now. <gasps> oh, uh, that's King ZR. I recognize him. Interesting. Itward has a lot of interesting things. Many things to look at. I wonder what kind of things this machine counts. Oh, this looks like this looks like a mathematical problem. Right. Okay. And then what about these books? Oh, so many pages to read. I hope they have pictures. And I just noticed all of the cats over here. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Jeez. The door is closed. Maybe Edward can open it later. Oh, is that Edward's room? I'm sure that that's like his room or something. So it looks like there's nothing else. Oh, the ladder leads to a door, but it's closed. Yeah, okay, it looks like I have to... Why is that a thing? Why is that a thing? <gasps> oh, oh! You guys are alive? Okay, no, 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 that's creepier. Um, <laughs> Are you, are you here to kill Itward? Hello, why won't you talk to me? Because you're dead, Fran, <laughs> that, that's why. Oh, a little key, I wonder what it's for. It's for this, 100%. It's, it's use. There you go. Let's see what happens. In a world made of darkness and light. Oh. Two little sisters tried to steal each other's charm. But none of the sides could decide. If what they were was just right. Mia was angry and Clara was sad. And this was because they were both mad. Oh, insane little girls. Inside of their minds? It were the creature of the night. He came always around in dreams or reality, teaching the girls the splendor of duality. But they couldn't understand Itward was a friend. It was, was the link between darkness and light. He was gray. But Clara and Mia one day decided to get rid of Itward once and for all. Die, creature of the night, die, they said. But they killed each other instead. Dead and gone. The sisters kept complaining about each other. It's all your fault, Clara. It's all your fault, Mia. Then Edward came to visit for the last time. And he said, You are both trapped in the world of disconnections. But I'll give you a chance. The world has been mean to you. They sewed your bodies together to prove that they could. They gave you a mirror to compare yourselves. I'll give you nothing but what you already have and just one tiny little chance to understand the purpose of life. But the clock is ticking. You have until the day a black cat goes missing <clears throat> and the well's magic door is unlocked. The end. Wait. 
Wait. So, did did it word purposely like stage all of this so we can kill Clara and Mia? It word. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, I feel bad. All right, let let's go back, back, Fran. Fran, let's go back. Oh, 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 wait, 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 okay. Um, let's go to the pills. <gasps> oh! Fraud! Hello? What do you do up to the other side? Seconds and minutes and hours and days. Tick tock, tick tock. I forgot to understand you. I forgot to give myself some love. Okay. TikTok, I get it. Oh, there goes the last one I need. I think that this is what I needed. A hose. It has a sort of connector. Yes, it does. And I'm pretty sure it's the hose that I actually need. Oh, and this too. Thank you, thank you. Oh, oh, this looks like a, this looks like a green octopus hose. Yes, Fran. Thank you. Okay, I knew I was missing some shit. <laughs> All right, so let's figure out where this goes. I'm going my diagram. This goes this way. And then... Where does this one go? Where does this one go? This one has like a... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is it to this? Do you somehow connect over... Somewhere? I don't know. Okay, um. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, can I? There it is, okay, there. I was about to say, I'm like, wait a minute. Okay. Okay, so now. Okay, so, um. A A AFM, which I'm assuming that's the the berries, and then A18 goes in this one. Okay, and then 2PF goes in this one, and then R15 goes in this one. N166 goes in this one. There we go. I think it is done. Super chemistry master, Fran Bo. <laughs> awesome. So do I just take this? <clears throat> what? Do I? Okay. How, how, how do I take the mixture? <laughs> or is it going to like pump itself into this? I filled it with the water. Mr. It Word! Sir, can you tell me again what I was supposed to do? Sure! Get the water pump working and the fuel mixed. Just follow the wall, wall you knows. It's like manual, but on the walls. Right, okay, thanks. Okay, thanks, 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 thanks. Okay, so, um. Oh, wait, dog, read, read this, okay. Led la ful <laughs> um, in, in, in interesting. Oh, fire. Okay, okay. I, I need to put the match there. Do that. Switch it horizontal. Um, and that'll do. Okay. That's what I was missing. I was literally missing a match. <laughs> All right, use. I can't turn the fire. It turned on the fire. There's no gas coming from the pipes. Okay. Um. There. There we go. Ah! The pump is now filled with water. Yes, it is. What? Okay. Oh, a 
Edward! Fran, I finally managed to fix the automatic driver. Do you need help? No, we finished. We, we are big brains. I think I managed myself quite well, too. I did all you asked of me. Very well, Fran. Everything seems to be working perfectly. Yes, everything looks absolutely great. What should we do now, sir? Well, I wanted to ask if you are Fred Rabbits. There is a little rabbit in one of the rooms, and I'm... I'm deeply afraid of it. Would you like to help me get rid of it? <gasps> We're not going to stab it, are we? <laughs> a rabbit? I guess it depends on the rabbit, sir. With all things I've seen, I can't just imagine one kind of rabbit. Is it a chocolate rabbit, or one with horns and killer eyes? And then what if it was the one with the horns with killer eyes, uh, Fran? Are you completely okay with, with fending that off? You'll have to see it for yourself. It has a pink nose and blue boots. It's just sitting there. No blinking, no movement. It's staring all the time. I think it's a doll. It does sound very scary, sir. But show it to me. Otherwise, I will never know. Brave you are, dear. Follow me now. Okay, see... A Fran. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, Fran. Let's see what this rabbit looks like. Oh boy. Of course, it's this room. There, see? It's just sitting there. Isn't that strange behavior? It's just a toy, sir. It's a toy! From what I see, it's just a toy, sir. It won't move. Would you please try to make contact with it? I don't dare to touch it. All right, sir. I'll take the rabbit and show you there's nothing to be afraid of. All right, all right. Rabbit, rabbit, rabbit. See, it's just a fluffy rabbit. Nothing to be afraid of. Fran, if that shit snaps your neck, I swear to God. <laughs> Oh, you're right, Fran. There is nothing to be afraid of. Mr. Midnight! What? Don't go! M Mr. Midnight, this is not funny. It is not funny. Okay. I am running on time here. <laughs> So, unfortunately, even though I wish, wish, wish to continue on, it looks like we are in, I guess, phase two of this spaceship area, but Itward stole Mr. Midnight and we lost him again. Mr. Midnight was probably cleaning himself, minding his own damn business, and then Itward just snatched him from us, but... That was a pretty dirty trick. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that, that was a pretty dirty trick from Itward. I'm sure we have to figure out how to get out of this room. And already from examining, I see number cards numbered one through five. I'm sure that's gonna that's some significance on like, I guess the order of things that I need to examine these or do or whatever. <laughs> But anyways, thank you guys so, so, so much for joining me on this episode. Hope you have an awesome day, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!